Hey guys, Prowl1701 here, and we've got another unboxing video. Kind of a nice little Christmas unboxing. Seems like a good Christmas video. So uh, this one is actually from Steven, who has sent one before. He's the one who sent that really big one, the biggest one I've ever gotten, the biggest piece of fan mail I've ever gotten a few months back. It was huge. It had like Star Trek books, Doctor Who books, a bunch of the 13th Doctor comic books, which I really ended up enjoying. Uh, the 13th Doctor Sonic Screwdriver, a pop, there's a bunch of stuff. It was huge. Uh, and I noticed when I got the alert something was coming, that it was coming from the same neck of the woods that one did, because that's something that sticks in your mind. So I was wondering if it was from the same person, and when I saw the name on it, Steven, I'm like, yeah, that, I think that's from the same one who sent me the big one. So we got another box here, and it seemed like Christmas would be, you know, a, a good time to, um, to do that. So I'm kind of excited about it. I have no idea what it is. Um, I don't actually know if Steven's ever identified himself down in the comments. Cause I, like I have a patron that's a Steven, but I, it's not quite his neck of the woods. And then uh, Steve who sent me a couple things, but I don't think it's him cause he goes under Steve. So I'm not quite sure who this is. Like if there's someone that's active down in the comments, um, I, I hope they tell me so I can thank them. I certainly appreciate it. I, I always love getting fan mail. Uh, especially, you know, around Christmas time. That's really neat. So I don't know what it is. We're going to uh, get into it, see what all we got here. Hope everybody's having a fantastic Christmas, by the way. Getting to spend time with family. Uh, if that's your Christmas wish, I guess. Uh, some people might, you know, their Christmas wish might be to get away from family. <laughs> My best friend has four kids. His Christmas present would probably be a week alone with everybody with nobody able to reach him in a secluded area. <laughs> uh, see what we got here. We got bubbles. I see bubbles. I see, oh, it looks like we have a card. I see some books. I see a tie. I think that's a tie. We have a card. Let's read the card first. Oh, I'm glad I put my glasses on. It says, Dear Prowl, Hello, I hope this card finds you well. I am doing much better. I was sick a couple weeks back, much better. It says, congrats on 850 subscribers. Thank you, I'm very excited about that. Your channel continues to grow through your great content. I always look forward to watching your videos and seeing what new video ideas you come up with next. I do love coming up with stuff I've never seen other people do. That is definitely something I really like to do. I recently finished watching season 12 of Classic Who and just started season 14. I love season 12. It's one of my favorites. Love Tom Baker, my favorite doctor. The stories are just as good as I remember them. I really enjoy watching the bonus features as well. Me too. I'm, I'm chugging right along through the season two bonus features right now. I love the behind the sofas for them. I, I watched... Uh, the season two documentary, which to me is not long enough. It needs to be longer. I haven't watched the David Whitaker one yet. That one's next on my list. Um, it seems like I always learn something new about the show uh, seeing them. I agree. I'm really excited to see what Russell T. Davis will do with the next season. Me as well. I can't wait for the return of Dr. Donna. I, Donna's my favorite Modern Who companion. I have included a few things to provide you content for the, to, for the channel or just for fun. Either way, I hope that you enjoy them and get some use from them. I look forward to future videos from you and for your continued success. Thank you. Stay well and keep doing what you're doing. I will continue to share your videos with my fellow Whovians. I appreciate that as well. Sincerely, Stephen. Thank you, Stephen. I appreciate that. And it's always nice to know that uh, people are sharing my content with other Whovians as well. And we will chug right along and see what we have here. We have the Stones of Blood, which with the new logo. So this looks like a maybe a reissue of an older Target novel, The Stones of Blood, which is a good one I like from the, uh, the Key to Time. We have Alex Kingston's The Ruby's Curse, a little river song right there. What is this? Let's see. We have, I'm gonna have to 
set this down and open this up real quick. This looks like, this is a big hard back one. It looks like Peter Cushing stuff. Oh, cool. This looks awesome. We have the official story of the films. I love the look of this. And there's the back, Doctor Who and the Daleks. That's awesome. I really enjoyed this movie. I've seen Doctor Who and the Daleks. I really enjoyed the movie. I still need to watch The, the Invasion of Earth, the second one. I just realized recently I hadn't done that. I think Fly Attractor sent me those. I need to watch the second one. That looks good. I love that art. I am definitely looking forward to giving this a looking at. This looks fantastic. That is awesome. And then it looks like we have a Star Trek novel. Uh, Harm's Way, in which I love Star Trek, the original series. Excellent. The acclaimed Vanguard series. I'm not familiar with that, so I'll have to give that a look. I love original Star Trek, though. So I'm looking forward to getting into that. I had read one of the Star Trek books he sent me last time, and I had a review uh, for that one up. I remember doing the review on it. This one looks interesting. I'll have to read the synopsis for it. Um, could use a good Star Trek novel. It's been a minute since I've read one. And this looks like a, a tie, a TARDIS tie. I like that. Nice little TARDIS tie. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Pretty cool. Next time I need a tie, I've got one already. Um, although it's been so long since I've tied a tie, I'll probably have to watch a YouTube video. You know, I've learned how to tie a tie more times than I've ever learned anything else in my life, I think. It's like I learn how to do it, but I so seldom do it that the next time I have to do it, I have to relearn how to do it. I've probably learned how to tie a tie half a dozen times in my life. More than I've ever learned anything over and over and over. But that looks awesome. So yeah, that's that's pretty neat. I, I really appreciate that, Stephen. That's a fantastic Christmas present. I appreciate you sending that. Um, and I hadn't forgotten that you sent that last one. I think that's still the biggest one I've ever gotten. So I really, really appreciate all of that. I'm especially looking forward to going through that Doctor Who and the Daleks book. That looks amazing. I see a review coming for that bad boy. And then reading the Stones of Blood as well. I like the Stones of Blood. The TV episode is an interesting one for me for Stones of Blood because there's aspects of it I like and aspects of it I don't. But the aspects of it I like outweigh the aspects of it I don't. So that, one's all, that one is a good one in my book. I'm looking forward to seeing how the novelization does it. So if you've enjoyed this video and if there's anything you would like to send me, my P.O. box is down in the description below. Um, I always appreciate getting stuff. I love doing unboxing videos. Uh, and it always means a lot that people like my content enough that they, you know, they take time out of their day to, and spend, you know, part of their finances to send things to me to look at. That, that always means a lot, and I always appreciate it. Um, I also have a uh, link to my Amazon wish list down there if there's anything you'd like to send me from that. And a link to my Patreon, which does help me keep bills paid. That's down there as well, if you would like to consider becoming one of my patrons. Uh, I also would appreciate just if you click the like button and the subscribe button. That helps me out. I am very much enjoying watching the channel grow recently, having crossed over 850 subscribers. I really am trying to hit 1,000. There's so many things I can do with the channel when I hit 1,000, so I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, really looking forward to trying to grow Doctor Who, uh, grow the channel next year uh, in 2023, Doctor Who's anniversary year. Really, um, I got a lot of things I really want to do with the channel. I've had several people that want to see live streams. I'd love to do live streams, so I think I've got to hit a thousand subscribers for that. So working on it and a few other plans I have in mind. Uh, most importantly, I want to give a shout out to some of my top tier patrons, Stephen Crane and Colin Coney and Finn Perkins. And I definitely want to give a thank you to um, Stephen here, Stephen R, uh, for sending this. I definitely appreciate this package. I, it, it looks like some fantastic stuff here, great Star Trek novel, some great Doctor Who stuff, and I love the look of that hardback Doctor Who and the Daleks book. And also, as always, thank you for watching.